Welcome to Get U Plugins tutorial series. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can enable color swatches for manually created attribute variations. In the last tutorial, I explained how you can display color swatches for globally created attribute variations. You can find the video tutorial link in the description below. To enable color swatches for manually created variable product attribute variations, you have to enable the pro version of WooCommerce variable swatches plugin beside the free version. After that, enable the edit mode for your desired variable product and get to the product attribute tab from the product data. Select attribute to reveal the variation. You can notice my pattern attribute has red, blue and green variation. They are separated by pipe sign. Let's head to the swatches settings tab to specify the attribute type. You can notice that default attribute type select is currently enabled. Switch to the color from the select type and save the settings. Head to the product front end to see the changes. It looks weird, right? It's because we haven't specified the variation color for the pattern attribute yet. Now get back to the product edit mode. Click on your product attribute from the swatches settings tab. For my end, I have selected pattern attribute. After selecting product attributes, it will show all its attribute variations. For my end, pattern attribute has red, green and blue variations. Let's select the red variation to reveal its settings. Set red color from the color picker. Next to it, select green variation and choose green color from the color picker. Do the same for the last blue variation. Select blue variation and specify blue color from the color picker. After adding colors for your entire attribute variations, select save swatches settings button. Now head to the product font end. Now you can notice my red, blue and green variation for pattern attribute have its identical color. So that's all for today. Don't forget to subscribe. Stay connected.